am blessed, I'm beloved, and I'm renewed. Beautiful, right? Because that is ultimately this working with this energy of death is leading to renewal, resurrection, resets. And I feel like that, <laughs> that's coming, in, like I feel that in my heart really huge right now. So, okay. As we come into stillness here, being invited to use the breath to ascend onto this vehicle of breath, to breathe deeply into the center of your being. And as you breathe out, breathing out first anything that does not serve you, breathing in light and beauty and love, and now breathing out gratitude. Beauty breaths, and as you breathe, breathing in light, beauty, and love, breathing out gratitude, feel yourself come to center, into the center of your being, as though everything, all your energy was collapsing in on itself and coming into this peaceful center becoming heavier like the iron core of the earth finding your magnetic core and working with this mineral hematite feeling heavy and solid And feeling that magnetic core of the earth, feeling it in your own physical center, coming into the body, with each breath coming deeper into the body, And feel that sense of magnetism, the center of your physical being. Now with the breath, connecting with your own magnetic center. Now sending that breath down the exhale down into the magnetic core center of the earth. And as you bring your breath back up into your own magnetic center, feeling that magnetic pull between yourself and the earth. Let's give a few deep breaths up into our own magnetic center and down into the core of the earth sewing those two together, finding ourselves magnetically drawn and connected with the magnetic core of the ascended earth, the higher earth, the physical aspect of the higher earth. And drawing our physical body closer and closer to the body of the healed Mother Earth and feeling her love, feeling that great, deep vastness of the Mother as though we are seated on her lap seated in the lap of the mother and of the grandmother 
and all the mothers before us to the great mother. Feel that connection of being held in the arms of the great mother and feel the ancestors holding you. All the ancestors from your mother, your grandmother, your great grandmother, great great grandmother, and these are their higher selves holding you, being held, all the love that maybe was missing, any love that was missing in that mother relationship, feeling that being fulfilled now, healed, restored as it spills from the great mother to the earliest mother ancestors. Anything missing to those earliest ancestors now being replaced, re replenished, filled with mother love and spilling from those ancestors to the mothers even closer to her great, 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 many times great grandmothers. Any mother love that was missing in their lives, they did not receive now being restored and replenished. And spilling like a series of waterfalls now. Well, grandmothers, from earliest recorded history, spilling into their hearts, into their fields, replenishing, restoring the mother love, the mother love connection to its fullest degree. Replenishing that avalanche of mother love. The full field of mother love cascading down to those earliest of recorded history mothers, great grandmothers in your lines, in your genetic line, and also spiritual teachers, any mothers on the spiritual side that may not be blood relatives, but mothers of the spiritual hierarchy or the spiritual relationships. Allowing that mother love to spill over until each one is full to overflowing and then allowing the generation after that to fill to overflowing with deep, dark mother love of coming into your known ancestors and imagine hold these beautiful mothers in the mind's eye and visualize this beautiful dark deep mother love spilling over from the original great mother all down through the line spilling over into these hearts these souls anywhere that has been neglected or anywhere where the mother love has not been fully felt and given and received allow it to be received now allow the receiving to happen to full fulfillment you visualize these beautiful mothers that you're aware of whether it's great 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 grandmothers our great great grandmothers and spilling down from one generation to the next overflowing with this beautiful deep dark mother love unconditional love the mama bear the love that just never ends the love that never 
finds a bottom that never finds an end. Eternal love spilling now into the great grandmothers, fulfilling to overflowing this deep, dark light. And now into the grandmothers. Oh, those grandmothers. See her held by arms and arms and arms and arms and arms of all the mothers before her down to the great mother. See them held and feel that energy overflowing into the arms of your own mother to the heart of your mother, to her crown, down through the crown and filling and filling and filling and filling anywhere where she did not receive what she needed, anywhere where she felt unloved, especially by her own mother or grandmother, erasing that now, erasing that lack, filling it and filling it and filling it until it bubbles and overflows with this joyful, joyful, bubbling, deep, dark energy like black champagne, flowing now through the blood, flowing through the breath, flowing through the eyes as tears, any weeping that wants to happen, allow it to happen, allow it to flow, knowing that is part of the love of the mother, letting the tears flow and filling the empty cavities with love. And now from the great mother all the way down the mother line, open to receive, open to receive this beautiful love energy, the bear, the mother bear love, the great mother love, open your heart to receive this, open your hands to receive this, open your crown to receive this, open your ears and your eyes, your third eye, the pores of the skin, cleansing and clearing and filling, working through all the veins and arteries, all the capillaries working through, all the lymph working through, the neurons filling the organs of the body, every cell, this deep, dark blackness, this blackness of light, this mother love washing, washing away any lack. We are held and feel the weight of this, this comforting weight, like a lead blanket, like being tucked in at night, knowing that all is well, knowing that the mother, that mother is home, she's at peace. and feel that joy, just like Christmas Eve, just being aware of the surprises in store. Things will be different in the morning, and this is a source of joy. giving thanks to the Great Mother for holding us safe in all directions. For our ancestors on the feminine line for holding us in love in all directions and feeling that love pouring through to us from the sacred direction of East. Holding open that portal to new beginnings, holding open that portal to light in the rising sun, holding it open in the sacred direction of south holding us 
in full remembrance and in full glory in this direction of south our full potential as human beings bridging the material and the spiritual the earth and the sacred sun holding us in our full potential giving thanks in the sacred direction of west allowing us to release that which is no longer serving us release anything that is ready to be released at this time that needs to be released in order for us to step through this portal of renewal and giving thanks to all energies that have been with us that are ready to be released giving thanks to the releasing letting them go releasing them into the arms of the great mother knowing they will be tended to in ways that are proper and putting them to rest and or renewing those energies and then also being thanks to this direction of north the clarity and the willingness to move forward the strength and the courage and knowing how to reconnect with the rhythms of the cosmos with the res rhythms of resurrection the sanctity of love. Marching forth now. Renewed, replenished. Compassion in our hearts. into a new era and giving thanks also for the space now that we're holding the space holding this beautiful sacred womb space we are now standing in sacred space having called on the divine mother hold us safe having called on the sacred ancestors and healing the ancestral line all the way back to Eve the first mother first human mother and every ancestral energy of life healing this beautiful feminine energy holding us safe, holding us, holding us and giving us strength, allowing ourselves now to receive from the feminine side, the feminine strength of holding, of holding space, the feminine strength of bringing forth from nothing, into the world, the feminine strength of creative life and materializing and bringing life into being, bringing the thoughts and the words into physical being, into presence. We feel the strength of the mothers connecting us human to human, heart to heart to heart, reweaving the tapestry, the tapestry of humanity, of, of human consciousness, reweaving anywhere that it has been torn, 
or damaged or burned. Calling on the beautiful, sacred aspect, the divine aspect, the healed aspect of spider, the grandmother spider calling on her to be with us, to heal and reweave any rents in the veil. her beautiful slender threads of light see grandmother spider as a white crystal being filled to the brim with love a being that is fully satisfied and fulfilled and who's only desire now is to share the light to give what she has received to recycle any darkness into light and spinning that light behind her into beauty and see her spinning now around us a beautiful three-dimensional circle an orb of protection a protective light this beautiful web of starlight weaving around your being your aura your field, each one of us being contained in this protective net and inside is light. And feel your heart opening up, allowing the heart to shine forth, allowing the throat to open and allowing this protective web as the drops of cosmic dew land on this orb allowing those drops of nourishing starlight to drip down now through the crown over the third eye to the throat soothing the throat allowing the throat to open and expand cleansing also that third eye and crown so that we may see, see clearly through the veil, that we may see clearly through the veil, that we distinguish light, true light from false light. That we speak the truth as we are revealed as it is revealed to us without obstruction and allowing this nectar, this divine nectar to flow down now into the heart, replenishing the heart, renewing, revitalizing, and from the heart through our arteries through our circulatory system, through the lymph, pumping that beautiful, nourishing nectar of life to all parts of the body. As above, so below, to all parts of our auric field. To every aspect of our being, all levels and layers of our being, filling our field with light. And inviting Grandmother Spider 
also to continue her sacred creation, weaving her sacred tapestry, weaving orbs of protection around our homes, around our loved ones, weaving an orb of protection around humanity itself and the earth our beautiful mother earth filling her with light now seeing in the mind's eye all these orbs of light surrounding the earth surrounding our great mother earth these orbs of starlight, of divine light, that we are joining together, joined together in harmony and beauty, seeing these threads of light connecting us heart to heart to heart to heart to heart. Light that cannot be ex extinguished unstoppable and seeing that flare brighter with the pulse of the universe the pulse of the cosmic heartbeat feel ourselves come back into sync with the pulse of the cosmic heartbeat and through our hearts beating as one connecting now with the heart of mother earth sending her strength as we are connected without obstruction to the great mother of the universe the universal mother we are connected to her and we breathe her love directly into the core, the heart of Mother Earth. The great divine reset of the feminine. Holding her in the love of the Great Mother. So that she may rise again that she may breathe easy that she may hold us all in her love releasing like a velvet cloak the old energies of the feminine that are no longer needed here like a worn velvet cloak in spring, allowing the beautiful Mother Earth to step up into the sunshine, weaving her a new cloak to wear, warm and bright and light, seeing her crowned with glory. divine bird song and the angelic harmony the music of the spheres inviting each one of us into the dance giving thanks now while beings holding space here. And giving thanks to Divine Mother, also to Divine Father. Knowing that his protection is always here, holding space for all of this. 
giving thanks to Mother Earth, my higher selves, all our spirit team, highest light. Allowing our spirit team to step back, bowing and turn to each of the four sacred directions, true east, true south, true west, and true north. Also the sacred directions above, below, and finally within, giving thanks in gratitude that the light shall and will prevail. Amen, 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 and it is so.